When you walk in the girls' room, there's such a beautiful bank of windows looking out onto the water. Suzanne has furnished the room with just a beautiful little settee sofa nestled into that nook underneath the windows. It's built into the eave of the roof, so there's a little bit of a slanted roof line to it. The showpiece in this room is really the bed. There's a beautiful white linen headboard that just sort of disappears up against the white walls and really to put all eyes on the beautiful patterned fabric on the bed. It just has such a pretty color and pattern on the duvet and matching pillows. And it just feels really youthful and just adds such a burst of energy to the room. The bed skirt matches the headboard but has been trimmed along the bottom with pink grosgrain ribbon and a double band. This room has just beautiful white Roman shades on all the windows and edged at the bottom with bands of this beautiful pink grosgrain ribbon. This room also has a great sense of symmetry to it with the bed centered right in the middle and a pair of bedside tables that are matching of sort of a nice worn wood with white lamps and shades on top. In the corner of the room, Suzanne's created a little bit of a reading nook with just a white linen upholstered armchair and side table and sort of a really pretty shell finish that's next to it. This room also has a big, beautiful mirror. It's made out of the same bone as the side table and just adds a little graphic sense to a big, expansive wall. There's a really fun bench that's covered in just a really soft, almost furry fabric, and it's got a pair of chrome legs, so it's a nice modern touch in the room. Suzanne has really accessorized with art in a really unique way. It's a series of prints, and they're very small. They're only about 12 inches by 12 inches, and they're square. And they're a framed series of different bands of paint in different colors that coordinate with the room. And it also kind of proves that you don't have to put all of your art in one spot. If you have a series of prints, they don't all have to go in one place together. You can make impact with putting three in one spot and then scatter the rest in different parts throughout the room. The girls' room really proves that even a small dose of color can have a really big effect.